I've learnt since coming here that I'm not as alone as I thought I was and that there are ways to help cope with life when you find it almost impossible like I did. I'm still struggling but I'm on my way to stopping self-harm and making myself sick and for the first time in what seems like forever I can actually see myself having a future again and that means more to me than I could ever express. When I first joined CAMS I was nervous but a bit anxiety at the same time but I am getting better but not recovered and also sometimes I hate the appointments when they're in the morning but it's worth it getting up. I can't remember when I first came but I was in a lonely state and now I seem to be getting better but not fully recovered yet. I'm slowly getting on the right track. It was the start of year eight when it all got too much. I rarely smiled and just felt really numb. To get rid of the numbness, sometimes I'd hurt myself in secret, but it didn't really help. My school noticed there was something up when I began to skip my PE and cooking classes out of fear that people would see myself harm injuries. Reluctantly, I agreed to go to my GP, although I continued to deny my problems. It was at this point I received my referral to CAMS. I was regularly overdose on my own at night before going to sleep in hope that I wouldn't wake up. For the three years at CAMS, I no longer hurt myself. I'm not better, but I'm getting there with the help of CBT and medication to balance out my mood and calm my anxiety. I'm determined to get better, and with the help of CAMS, I can see the light at the end of the tunnel. Um, it's quite simple, really. Before I started CAMS, I was stuck in a big black fog. No light, no way out. Literally nothing could penetrate it. And it's a long process. I'm not quite there yet, but CAMS are helping me. But now I'm, I'm starting to find that I can live my life better. I can start to live again.